Morning guys. Well, I'm early birding it. It's about 7.30. I've been watching the sky for about half an hour. It started off very, very pink in the east. And now these massive forms are here in the sky. Look at this. Over here a bit. Anyway, I have a bit of a theory which I'm going to um, think more on. I strongly recommend that people take time out of researching and just give their head some time to connect dots and assimilate their information because I've been taking time out over the last couple of days. Still watching the occasional vid, you know, but spending more time just sort of doing stuff. Like I walked the dog a couple of times yesterday and I've been sorting the house out and just thinking about things. I've been thinking about a lot of stuff. something over there. Let's have a look in. Look at this. They were um, putting a lot of little lines in earlier, but they seem to have ceased for now. And this may well move off in the same direction as the sun. See how this is coming clearer here now? With that strange. Well, there you go. If so, if you look at this, this is. Um, Skyline are coming in now. So you can see up here, this one seems to be dropping out of a formation up here. That's a chemtrail, that's not. There's a, a strange cloud formed across here. And I've got all this other stuff here. But this is only being revealed because the sun's coming up. And well, the sun isn't coming up, is it? The sun is moving across. And as it, move, it moves across, its light will refract and reflect off the firmament and, and reveal anything that's in the atmosphere below it. And this is what it's doing. I mean, this one here, I mean, why? It looks as if they're going up into the firmament. Is that the firmament? Is that what we're looking at up here? Are they craft? going to be the next thing, isn't it? Working out what they are. They're here. They're here below the sun. They're moving around us and they're revealed at sunset and sunrise and other times when the lights are right. Beings of light. Light beings. And at night you don't see anything. We've had um, really clear skies at night for about three nights now. Yeah. Flat plane. Light beams. Well, hey guys, this is um, one of my go-to sky channels that I watch. This is um, Seven Spalding's channel. 
Seven goes out there and he films the sky. Sunrise, sunset, all weathers. And he filmed this a couple of nights ago, this was at the 14th, so this was on Valentine's Day. And it's always this sort of, uh, <sighs> watch the sun go down and then pretty much watch it or something else come up again. But I don't know, I seem to see it a bit different this time. I think my um, internet is playing up, but look at this. So what was struck me was how flat it is, you see? It's very, very flat above here. See so here, this is flat. So I think that the sun the sun isn't going down, is it? If you're a flat earther, the sun isn't going down. The sun is continuing on its path over the flat earth. So it's actually going into the distance where we just can't see it anymore. But it will still be shining and reflect, refracting and reflecting on clouds that are below it and on the firmament. And I think these things are uh, in with us all the time. I think they're here. I think they're in our atmosphere and um, we just can't see them. Because the light's not right, the spectrum's not right. He catches the most incredible stuff. Absolutely incredible. You see how flat it is here. These clouds are in here with us and when the sun is at a certain angle, altitude, whatever, you get a different colour spectrum I think and it, it shows them, it shows these things, they're here in with us. And the other person I wanted you to show if I can get it to play. It's just being really awkward. This screen capturer isn't the best. Is uh, Jim. Jim S.A. Jim S.A. is another um, sunset, sunrise capture, capturer. And, um, Seven's in Cincinnati, Ohio. And Jim's in Texas and the same sort of thing again as the sun goes down look at that that's just incredible just look at that so just take the sound off Jim gets quite cross at people saying they're all chemtrails. <laughs> but I don't know what they believe in, whether they believe in a flat earth, a, a globe earth, a construct, an amoeba floating in space. I don't know what they believe in. And I don't care. What I, all I really care about is just sky watching and putting together information. I'm just trying to work out what on earth is going on. Now I think there's magic at play, I think there's alchemy at play. I think the elite you are using this event that is um, above us now for their own nefarious means. I think it's uh, magical. How can that not be magical? Look at it. And I think it's all about light and deception and light beings 
and maybe deities and craft and all sorts of stuff but I think it's here I think it's in here look at that do you see you see the amazingness of this and people are falling out all over the place as well people are falling out in the sky community people are falling out in the mud flood community I can't handle it man god um, don't fall out with people. Do you be coming together now? Or just working this thing out? But as you can see here, look, the sun's going down. But I can't even, I can't get it back because it's, things playing up. And these things show, they show in a certain light spectrum. This is a really good video of Jim as he's got some good shots in here but these guys go out in all weathers and are filming this so that people can see that our skies just aren't right see that there's something up there we, we all hypothesize as to what it could be there is a strong Nibiru community out there it might be Nibiru I don't know I don't even know what Nibiru is. All we have is what Zechariah Sitchin tells us. And then maybe we can sort of like, don't throw the baby out with the bathwater maybe, and um, come to our own conclusions. Look at that. So yeah, I'll leave the links to these two guys and um, a few other Sky Channel, uh, Sky Watchers, because everybody is taking the most incredible stuff now. And this isn't, how it used to be, is it? Hey? Something's occurring. <laughs>